everyone, Jim T. Graham with rcgroups.com. I'm here with you today because Revoc came on board as an advertiser this morning and they said, hey, listen, we have a new hybrid line that we want everyone to know about and we would like you to share it. So I went out and did all my research. I'm working on a feature article that you'll be able to take a look at. In fact, you might be looking at this video in the feature article now. If you're not, if you're on YouTube, down below in the description, there will be a link and that will give you all the other details that I'm not going to go over. Basically, what I'm going to share with you is a video of the product that I can't find on the internet. And I thought, well, you know, if they want me to share it, I should share it directly with everyone out there on our channel, which I think just cracked 23,000 uh, subscribers. I don't know. I'll have to take a look because I'm not on YouTube right now. But anyway, let's kick into this. I'm going to go look at my control panel here and uh, get everything rocking. Here we go. I'm going to hit the button and then I'm going to talk to you about this. So the hybrid line is their collection of bags designed with attention to detail, superior protection in mind. Each bag and this line is crafted from multiple layers of high-quality fabrics. As you know, Reebok, that's what they do. They make great bags and things out of uh, fabric that you can use in the field. This has triple-layer construction, an outer layer made from dur durable polyester fabric. They have colors like red and black and navy and gray. The middle layer is a three-millimeter layer of ultralight polyester wadding, and it's added between the outer and the inner layers. and the Lightweight material cushions your model, offering protection. And I know all about heating protection from uh, wings and things. A lot of the things I do to my aircraft is literally taking it uh, out of my truck or putting it in my truck. So that's why you need stuff like that. Um, once again, I'm going to click back over here. You need, if you have a hot dollar aircraft, or something that you've built and covered yourself, we all know what a heartbreak it is to damage it while you're unloading and loading and moving all your stuff. This is a quick video for you to check out, but once again, go to the description below. I'm going to have a lot more information. There's a lot of things that you can do with this unit, or it's not a unit, it's a line. So there's a lot of things you can do from adding your model ID uh, logo to it, to putting your username on RC groups on it, your actual name, your information, hooks to hang from the ceiling, um, equipment pockets, shoulder straps. In fact, hold on. Uh, we have a video here, so why don't we go ahead and share it? How will I do this? I'm going to move this over here and... So here's what we're going to do. We're going to actually take a look at this stuff. I'm going to jump over to the page. So here are some of the options. You have color options that you can use on these. Model ID logo that you can have printed onto your bags. Uh, hooks that you can use to hang from your ceiling or from whatever, you know, um, for me, it would be in my basement. Equipment pocket, which I love because if I have equipment specific to a model, I like to keep it with the model, and this would allow you to do that. Shoulder strap. You can look very cool cruising around the mall. Wait, does anyone go to the mall? But any, yes, a shoulder strap. Express shipping because you need this tomorrow because you're headed to a big show, and you must have this, although I'm sure they would have to make it. Bags for tanks. And things that would go with your scale aircraft, little uh, various and sundries, and cutouts for struts and tail links. It's everything. Come on, no wonder they uh, contacted me this morning and said we would love you to for you to talk about this. Different colors. It's all pleated. Uh, well, let me make sure I'm not missing anything. Wings and tails, and I think that kind of covers everything. So once again, um, this is all going to be in the feature article, which will be linked below. I just wanted to make sure I had all this in a, in a video that you could check out. I'm Jim T. Go check it out with the links. And we appreciate everyone who hits subscribe and like and does all the things that helps us share the hobby with everyone out there. And I'm out.